Hello everyone, I'm Carter D, and today we're playing Ashen. It's a brand new game. It's not even on Steam at this point. Um, yeah, it's a Dark Souls-like game, so I mean, I've never played I haven't seen anyone else play it or anything. Um, so yeah, let's jump in. I do like Dark Souls, so let's see. Uh, randomizer style. Um, masculine, feminine. Alright, let's make ourselves a nice little girl. Yeah, hairstyle. Firebrand. Uh, let's see. Nice. Ooh, I like that. Ooh, the pigtails are nice. The high ponytail or the low ponytail? I think we're going to go with the high ponytail. Perfect. Facial hair. Let's do that to none. Um, hairstyle. Was I missing color or something? Um... Oh, hair color right there. Uh, oh, I only get these to choose from? That's lame. I was hoping for, like, a bright green or something. Let's go with dark hair. Skin color. Oh, let's make us a little bit paler. There we go. Um, sure. Let's jump in. Except, like I said, I know nothing about this game. So, this is brand new to both of us. Or all of us. Alright. Oh. That looks nice. Ooh, nice music to go with it, too. Game by A44. They released it on their site, but not on Steam yet, so I had to buy it directly from them instead of on Among Steam. Among the stars, the ashen fly. Ooh. Beneath, the nine realms move among the tree of worlds' many branches. Sounds like Norse mythology. Proudly standing upon the darkness, its roots delving into caverns where light will never venture. It was when a single great ash flew down to rest upon her boughs that the light woke among the realms. Excited. After eons, the great Ashen grew weak with age and fell from the Tree of Worlds, oh no. resting upon the plains of darkness, drawing what few breaths remain. Go, birdie! In the throes of death, the light dimmed, no. and the Ashen's final three breaths became the three golden ages of light. The first age saw three creatures of the dark plains rise above all others. Your chest kind of open. The elder dark fed upon the light and thrived. <laughs> the second marked the coming of the listener matriarchs. They're born. Titans who revered the light. The third breath was the age of man. There we are. Geffen's children. When the final breath ended, there would be a time of darkness. In that black age, the cities of man fell into ruin. Oh, so it's already over. Toppled by war and emptied by pestilence and famine. Mm. Proud Lathyrus drowned beneath the ash. Well, that's, um, so just like Dark Souls, we're at the end of the age of light and fire and everything like that. From dust to flesh, from darkness to radiance, soon the Ashen will be reborn from the ruins of its old body, and a new age of light will begin. You're missing your arm. I served the Ashen long ago, a guardian to its waning light, even though it broke me with its brilliance. I think that's now, me. look to the mountain peak, for that is where fresh hope blooms. That looks like me. I mean, not like I can tell by the face. Well, that's good, because I'm terrible with faces, the too. is reborn. Behold the first glimmer of the light that will sweep the darkness from these plains. Ooh, that's exciting. 
Alrighty, we are up. We're moving. Here's a bonfire. Can I rest that bonfire? Oh, I'm such a dick. I just put up their bonfire. Who are you? Talk to me. Hello. Um, we are one. <laughs> okay, so attack. Faster looking attack. Whoa, buddy. All right, so there's that. I don't have a shield. Roll is still B. All right, buddy, talk to me. Again. The cliffs ahead should provide a good vantage point. Beware. The rebirth of the Ashen will be violent. Mm, good to know. Alrighty, so we're making our way out. Um, yep. It's like I don't have a shield or anything. I don't know if I get a shield. It does look like the entire world is covered in ash. And, whoa, oh, what am I missing? Oh! Oh, oh! Why, hello there, giant-looking thingamabob. I was just kind of looking for hidden items and stuff. It's always good to look for items. Um, ah, see, see, there was a thing. What is this? Pick up. A uh, bone spear. Um, switch panel is L1. Or L1. Oh, wrong thing. Uh, what? I don't know, take it. There we go, we got a bone spear. Uh, how do we add things? Let's see, uh, bone spiked club. Um, broken spiked club. Well, let's see, that just a help. Um, how, how, I'm confused. How come I can't equip the other weapon? <laughs> I want to equip the other weapon. All right, let's try, okay. Let's try again. Um, maybe in this side, belt slot, shield slot, belt slot. Really, two-handed weapon slot. Maybe. All right, let's see. Uh, damage is thirty ninety. Four. That sounds good. Oh. Well, there we go. That, can I can I flip it? Oh, holy poop! We have a jump option. <laughs> Man, this game's already beating Dark Souls on one thing. It's got a jump. All right. Still using stamina, but I am so happy to see a jump option. All right. So I don't know how to use my new weapon. Oh. I'm just kind of dicking around, seeing if... Oh! Oh, I did something. I, I don't know what that means. Okay. Yep. Oh, -ha, there we go. Huh. Huh, I have the Spear Maiden. Here's a bonfire. As a dick, I put that one out, too. Who are you? Keep the light. Hide it. Keep it. Save it. Um... Kind of put out your fire, sorry. Walking with shadows, you are. Whee! Alright, alright, it's looking decent, guys. Whoa, whoa. Oh, so ah, I see that, you know, pieces of something are falling off. Broken bone hatchet. Uh, yeah, I'll take. Oh, yeah, I see pieces are falling off of it. So, let's see, um... Damage is 36 uh, it, uh, or 30. I'm not sure exactly which one. Um, it does seem to be less damage than my broken spiked club. Wait. My bone spear is only 30? Okay, so it's the first damage. I don't know what the second damage means. But nonetheless, I'm still going to go with my spear. Hey, buddy. Are you seeing that thing? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, angry guy. Well, I was going to stab him, but okay. Take my kill, why don't you? What do we got here? Plank shield. Okay, plank shield's handy, because now we have a shield. Uh, yep, let's equip the shield. There we go. Now if we swap over our weapons... Oh, nope, not that button. Nope, not that button. There we go. Now we have... Aha! We have a shield. And a shield bash. To jump the gap. Oh, oh, that gap. <laughs> okay, but I am totally doing a running start. There we go! Haha! <laughs> Man, having a jump in like a Dark Souls game really increases the environment that you're that you can do. See that's one thing that Dark Souls has a problem with is there's all the jumping in the game is like very difficult to do. Or it's like by having a simple jump option. Ooh, more items. What do we got here? White 
Sapult. Instantly heals a moderate amount. Oh, perfect. It's a healing item. Perfect. Um, that's one thing that, you know, Dark Souls... Oh, and I can climb! That's one thing that Dark Souls really does suffer from. Ah, boom. Press Y to climb. Is, you know, having jumpable surfaces. Having, you know, climb abilities. Like, you can make the world 3D instead of, like, very flat. Like, sadly, I love Dark Souls, but it is flat. And that's one thing that, you know, that they just have to deal with is me sitting there going, your world's flat. Like, Dark Souls 1. Oh, 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 oh. Whew. I for sure thought I was going to die. Where am I? Oh. All right, so I fell. Um. Hello? Friend? Are you a friend? Hello? Pick up. Ooh, Apple Cricket. Increases stamina generation for a short time. All right, perfect. Sounds decent. Hello, friend? Nope. All right, this guy seems non-hostile. I'm okay with that. What about this thing? Ha! Die! Ha! <laughs> Murder! Ha 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 Oh, man, that rabbit thing had no idea what hit it. It was me. I hit it. <laughs> Alright, find this. But yeah, that's what I was saying, though. So, like, Dark Souls never added in a 3D environment for, like, you know, where you can scale. You go up and down. Everything's elevators, platforms, and fall down. But it's like, you never get the option of simply just climbing. Them shadows. He's always watching. Yeah. I hear ya. Ash suckers. Nothing but trouble. Wait, am I the shadows? Get away with you. You guys are kind of rude. Raffus, oh. keep your mitts off me, Ruff. Well, you're just rude. Uh, let's run a bit. The only thing I'm not currently down with right now is the very slow run. I mean, walking speed. Apple cricket. There we go. Another one of those. There we go. Um, da -da -da. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Is this where we came from? Um. Not, well, I mean, I was over there. I'm not exactly sure where we came from. I, I think we came from up there. Anyways, I'm getting lost. <laughs> like, been here for like five seconds already lost of where I am. I think I came from that direction, so... Ooh, there's a guy over there. Are you an enemy? Huh? Enemy? Enemy? Oh, I think you're my partner. Ooh, what is this? What is this? There are those that thrive in perpetual night and would extinguish these fledgling rays. We must find the Ashen and protect it from the Elder Dark. Not the Elder Dark? That's a lot of light. Ash. Ah. I don't really know what I did. I didn't get to kill a guy like my partner dude did. It's like, come on. Let me kill stuff. I mean, if you have a partner, it kind of takes away from the challenge of, oh, I fell. No. Sploosh. I'm alive. Uh-oh. Buddy, friend, you okay? Oh, you're fine. Okay. You got a cigar? Oh, no, you got a pipe. Uh, you just survived. You don't want to, like, kill yourself by smoking. So you're responsible. Alrighty, let's see. What do we got here? We have... Oh, white sapota? Or sapot? I don't know. I'm not good with names. Find this. Check around. Check around the cave. Alrighty. Oh, go over to the light. Still very what bright. A sight. Our world once more bathed in ashen light. Oh. You have felt the power of the ashen and survived. We will need that strength of yours. Okay. The ashen is still a sleeping child. Vulnerable. We must wake it from its slumber. I don't have a face. Before we begin our journey, we must bind your spirit to a ritual stone. A what? If misadventure takes you, the stone will act as a beacon from beyond death's veil. Safe point. I get you, buddy. 
Uh, hammer and spark. What do you want? What? <laughs> that guy's just all like, goodbye! Ooh, map. Ooh, there we go. Placid stream. Alright. So we're following one. Oh, I'm gonna kill this buddy. Get over here! Yeah! <laughs> oh man, that bunny had no idea what was going after it. Alright, I don't want to go that way. I want to explore a bit more this way. Lock on to enemies. Okay, can I, can I lock on the bunny? Alright, I'm just killing bunnies for fun. I'm not seeing, like, an experience meter or something. That's probably the number that's, um... Come on, just... Ah. Did I kill it? I can't tell. That's probably the number that's underneath, like, where my stamina bar is. Is That's probably, like, my soul's number or something. Ooh, I love the sliding physics. Um, it's probably, like, my soul's counter. Can I climb this? I cannot. There's people up there. Or they're bad guys. One of the two. See, and that's a nice way of also dealing with it. It's simply by, um... You know, if you get to an edge of a map or something like that, instead of just being all like, here's an invisible wall. Instead, like, have it so it's like your character actually, like, slides down because you can't climb it. But anyways, that's enough time for now. Um, brand new game. Looking forward to playing more. So uh, keep watching, and soon you'll be able to see more of me playing this. And until then, you guys have a great evening, and bye bye